Hi, I'm Yo-Yo Bandelore, and today I'd like to show you a construction technique that can be used to make a uh, pentagonal bipyramid like this, or a uh, flat pentagon, a uh, pentagonal trivet as I call it, or a uh, pentagonal frame like this. <clears throat> and the way you start off is most of you probably know how to make a pentagon. So I'm going to make a three wrap pentagon. Oop, there we go. So there's our three wrap. And then what I do is I take this last layer here and I bring it back or pull it back over. Can I push the second one level through? Come through and tighten up all the corners so we've got good connections there and there is how we start. And you notice this has a bit of a trough here. So what I'm going to do now <clears throat> is go back in and fill in that trough. Alright, so we've got our first level there. This is probably the smallest uh, trivet and actually smallest frame that you can make. And then what you do is you just keep adding to the outside here. So you see we have another trough, so I'm going to fill that in. Now depending on whether you want to make a, a pyramid, uh, a frame, or a trivet, uh, if you want to make a pyramid, you fill everything in here. If you want to make a frame or trivet, then you're going to have to take things off as you go along. So I'm going to flip over and take off this layer here so it's flat and then come back over here and put in let's see there get that cleaned up in there go in good did it that's a little bit better so there we have our next size trivet that's flat if you want to make a frame then you're going to take out more things you're going to take out more in the center here. So there we have a frame. And again, if you wanted to fill in everything, things off here, don't mean to. Finally, so I filled in one side there so I've got more of a pyramid as opposed to a bipyramid. This side I can just leave as flat. Now one of the cool things about the uh, pentagons, you may have already found out, is they make great tops. Oh, let me get this back on screen. So that was just a little one I made there. So it spins really well. As you get more mass, oh, oh. <laughs> thought that might happen. Your little mass, they'll spin for a nice long time. You can even take another single magnet and put in your trivet here, and it makes a nice top. So this is a, a unit that's probably familiar to most magneteers, but some of the newcomers uh, may present a challenge, so that's why I was doing this tutorial to help them uh, get over the hump. So I hope you enjoy it. You guys have a good day, and I look forward to your comments.